What's your sign? I'm a cancer. Body built like a dancer. Shake that ass. And you better twerk for a blessing. You better twerk for a blessing. You better twerk. You need a blessing. You better twerk. Okay. Cancer, welcome to your Dante Tarot, August 2022 reading. How you doing, babe? Cancer, right off the bat, um, you know, you kind of just moving along with the stream. You moving along with the um, direction in which things are going during this time. You know, you're really not trying to force anything off the bat. You know, you're starting in this month on a good note, on a good foot. You see? Second card, confirming. Exactly. You're not holding back at all. I see you moving forward, you know. You're completely uh, driving some manifestation forward. You're not holding back at all within yourself. I see you going on a trip. I see you traveling um, within these next few weeks. My darling, I see you just getting prepared. I see you just preparing your intention. I see you preparing exactly how you're going to do things and unravel them. Um, they're going to work out beyond what it even is that you think. You know, you're going to excel so nicely. God is so proud of you. God is literally so proud of you. God is behind you. Leo season is literally your season. You have no idea. I see some project that you're working on, Cancer, going from like a small project to a big project that's going to turn out really big. You know, you're going to set your intention and then you're going to be surprised at what it turns out to be, you know, what it unfolds to be. You're about to be recognized for whatever this is. You're about to be noticed for whatever this is. You know, congratulations, bitch. I see you looking so beautiful, so popping, so enlightened, so realized. It's giving JT and Carisha. It's giving the city girls, bitch. We done took everybody's shit. Now we on top. Now we the head bitches. It's giving city girls, literally. Um, you are feeling a little tired, you know, um, of having to upkeep this image, of having to work so hard to maintain this luxury, to come into this position. But, you know, it's what comes with the territory. And I see you're going to realize that all throughout the month, you know, it's what comes with the territory completely. I see you making some new friends. You're definitely going to have some established people wanting to connect with you, make some offers with you, um, you know, just kind of like share space with you during this time. Um, you are going to feel at certain times like uh, you're not going to know what direction to go in. But, you know, in those situations, just rest, you know, and allow time to work in your favor, you know, and develop for you. That's how true that is. Um, yeah, you just got to play the fool in those moments, you know. Mm -hmm. um, I see beyond August. You're going to be um, focusing on your finances and you're going to be making some investments in September. Um, this month may not be necessarily a financial month. Finances may just be consistent, you know, but September is literally going to be a nice uh, cushion for you. Um, as you're walking into September, my darling, I see you making some radical changes within yourself. You know, this month is really going to be good for you from an emotional standpoint. I love it. And you also going to finish realizing, you know, some fake nosy ass people within this time. You know, get rid of them now so you don't carry this into September. These people are realized in your energy. They're wondering what you're up to. They're wondering why you're spending so much time alone. Why you need to spend so much time alone. Why you move like that. You know, these people is all up in your business. Watching all your shit. They taking notes. And that's okay for people to take notes. You know, because you're living your life. You just have to perceive yourself as the main character that you are. You know, and not get distracted. You know? Don't get distracted. It's your world, literally, like Aphrodite. 